Jersey Sports Zone's coverage of Don Bosco Prep is brought to you by Jag One Physical Therapy. Hey, what's going on, everyone? I'm Jay Cook with JerseySportsZone.com here in Oradell. Bergen Catholic and Don Bosco Prep is the granddaddy of all New Jersey high school football rivalries here in the Garden State. The Ironmen and Crusaders clash after meeting in last season's non-public A state championship. Bergen Catholic breaks out brand new all-black uniforms as they look to win their 18th consecutive game. 2-2 two two Don Bosco aims to rebound after falling to Iona Prep last Friday night. On the first play of the game, Nick Minacucci takes a downfield shot to Bobby Mays. He hauls it in. That's a 31-yard gain right out of the gate. These two seniors shared a special connection on this first drive. It's Minacucci to Mays for six. That's a 16-yard strike. Don Bosco marches the field and scores an opening drive touchdown on the Crusaders. So how does Bergen respond? They get the ball in the hands of one of their top athletes. Kaj Sanders is running full speed to the end zone. That's a 69-yard touchdown. The Crusaders answer right back, and we've got a 7-7 game. Bosco would settle in after that long score. Check out Lamont Lester making his presence felt in the backfield. That forces a fourth down and a punt. Don Bosco would take over with a short field in front of him. Nick Minacucci is fearless. He keeps it right up the gut and moves the sticks. That is the last play of the first quarter. The Ironmen were moving the ball very well. Here's a dump off to Nolan James. He follows behind that massive offensive line for the score. In the first minute of the second quarter, Don Bosco has a 14-7 lead thanks to Nolan James. Bosco's offensive line imposed its will on Bergen Catholic's front seven. Look at these running lanes. Logan Bush picks up the first down here. Then it's Nolan James toting the rock behind Chase Basantis, Chris Marino, and Aiden Toomey. Bosco goes run heavy on this drive, and they get inside the five, setting up a touchdown for Logan Bush. Don Bosco has a 21-7 lead at the half. Here's a stat. This is the first time Bergen Catholic has trailed going into halftime since November 15, 2019. That was also against Don Bosco. Third quarter now. Bosco is in the red zone looking for another score, but DJ Samuels comes flying in for the sack. This Bosco drive would ultimately stall, but Jack Donnelly hits a 24-yarder. That extends the lead to 24-7. Bergen Catholic would lose a fumble on the ensuing kickoff, giving the Ironman possession inside the 20, and Bosco continues to feed Nolan James. He gets the call here from six yards out, and the talented sophomore has his second touchdown of the game. After three full quarters, Don Bosco is in total control with a 31-7 lead. The Ironman defense came into this game allowing just shy of 35 points per game. That changed on Saturday. Matt Severin has the pick here, and this turnover seals the win for Don Bosco. 31-7 is the final. What a performance from the Ironmen. Bosco's game plan was run heavy, and it was successful. The backfield handled 49 carries for 237 yards. The all-senior offensive line dominated. Bergen Catholic's vaunted front seven in the trenches. Yeah, it was uh, definitely important. Um, it started in practice on Monday, and we knew what we wanted to do, and today we came out and executed. I mean, we're rolling, um, so it was great to beat those guys my senior year. We didn't do it last year, like you said, um, so it was a great feeling. Man, all five of those guys are battle-tested guys. They come to work every day, all right? They're a tight unit, and, you know, they were opening up some lanes for our guys inside today, and you know what? I, I think they're just going to keep getting better and better, and they're, we, we, they're going to they're give us a chance to score a lot of points, man. It, it, all, all five of them played well from, from left to right, man. Solid performance. Bergen Catholic goes on the road next Friday night to face DePaul Catholic. 
brothers Vito and Nick Campanelli will face off for the first time as head coaches. Don Bosco goes to MetLife Stadium next Friday night as they play St. Peter's Prep in what is sure to be another incredible game. Reporting from Oradell, I'm Jay Cook with JerseySportsZone.com.